your CBS 47 pinpoint weather forecast. Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday, and we're watching our storm system roll into our area. Yesterday got a little bit of a snow up around the Mineral King area, Sequoia National Park. That's about the 9,000 foot level there. You can see the water droplets on the lens, and the system is rolling in. Going to bring a good amount of snow today for the higher elevations, but it's going to be very high, around 8,000 feet. So high snow level with this system. Most areas will be seeing rain and could get quite a bit of it. Average temperature is 59 degrees. Right now we're already at 60 degrees. That's where we stayed overnight. We stayed warm with those clouds and not warming up much. We'll stay in the low to mid 60s all day long. Our rainfall totals, we are short more than an inch of rain. This system promises up to a half inch, mainly up in the North Valley, so lesser amounts as you head further south. But combine that with what we're going to see on Sunday, could be an inch total for the heaviest parts of the valley. Could get several inches for the foothills and mountains, and obviously that can cause some problems. So here's our next front. It's moving into our area. The rain mainly north of our area around San Francisco to Sacramento. That's the main front. We had a couple of scattered showers this morning. Very, very light, uh, up to two, three hundredths of an inch, some trace amounts in areas. Uh, enough to wet the roads, but the bulk of the rain is still north of us and going to slide into our area today. As it moves through, it's moving that air, so it makes it very windy, and there's going to be a wind advisory, 40 mile an hour gust, or possibly even up to 45 miles per hour. So that's going to make driving difficult, especially if you're in a tall vehicle or a truck, especially along the I-5. You do want to watch out for that through 10 tonight. For the foothills and the mountains, over the weekend we have a flood watch. This is going to be Saturday evening through Sunday evening. It's for the Sierra from Yosemite down to Kings Canyon, also for the Madera, Mariposa, and Fresno County foothills. This means that we can see floods happening. Rivers, creeks, and streams are going to be at the top of their banks, can overflow, and that could lead to rock and mudslides, debris flows, so watch out for that as well by Sunday. For the valley, again, we mentioned that happened to rain. About a foot of snow with this first round. Could see another foot or two with the next round, but again, high snow levels and then more heavy rain on Sunday before things clear out. Another hope of rain by the middle of next week, so hopefully the door will stay open for more of these storms to move through. You can see we have the front kind of stalled out over uh, Northern California there, right there, bringing those clouds through our area, and that's going to be our main front today, so it's thin, and then we're going to see that next storm be spun around behind that. So our main forecast model brings the bulk of the rain right through Central California around noontime, reaching Fresno. Yellow is a pretty steady rain. You can see that goes till about 3, 4 o'clock, then kind of tapers off. Some scattered showers into the evening. Snow will continue, but things should be pretty dry for the valley for tomorrow. For Saturday, ahead of our next storm system rolling in by Saturday night, but scattered showers still possible. 61 degrees in Fresno right now. Winds out the east at 9 miles an hour down there. 20 mile power winds in the North Valley right now. We're in the low to mid 60s for your high today. 63 to 65 for most parts of the valley. We'll be in the upper 50s to low 60s for the foothills, 40s and 30s for the mountains. And your air quality today is good, so you are allowed to burn wood. There are no wood burning restrictions, and your Boz pollen count remains low for pollen, but moderately high for mold, 7 out of 10 count. So again, 7-day forecast, heavy rain today, midday, some evening showers by Saturday. Should be a pretty dry day, heavy showers, uh, heavy rain actually by Sunday for the mountains. Uh, heavy snow today, heavier snow by Saturday afternoon into Sunday. Now let's check out our CBS 47 pinpoint traffic report presented by Bank of the West. Once again, looking good in the city of Fresno. No major problems to report. Merced, you do have that lane closure southbound 99 at Highway 140, and there are no other problems to report. Zara, back to you. All right, Jenny, thanks. The holiday spirit alive this morning at the happiest place on earth. Mike Scott joining us live this time from California <laughs> Adventure. I love it when it's all decked out for Christmas, Mike. Is this awesome or what? Yeah. And even though it's lightly sprinkling this morning here at California Adventure, we're going to have a good time. We're in Cars Land. You want to see some neon? Look at this. That is Flo's V8 Cafe. <laughs> they have more neon here than you will ever see. But come on in. Patty joins me this morning. She's one of these Flo's waitresses. How are you? Good morning. I'm well, thank you. I've heard rumors you've been to lovely Fresno for the Miss California <laughs> pageant. Is that true? <laughs> I've frequented Fresno. I like to call it Fres, yes, personally. <laughs> but uh, here at Flo's is my home now. And this is my pal DJ. Have you gotten a chance to meet him? I have not. I have oh. not. Is it true he's like the ultimate party machine car? Absolutely. See, his reputation precedes him. <laughs> yes, he's always rolling on into Radiator Springs, starting impromptu dance parties. Hey, speaking of dancing, you look like you got your dancing shoes on. There's nothing well. like dancing in the rain. <laughs> what do you think? Are you going to teach me to dance? He's got some amazing music. Aren't you amazing, DJ? You're going to love this back there. Do it, ladies. <laughs> so I have got an idea. Here at Radiator Springs, we like to do it. What do I have to do? We like to do a little dance called the car wash. So we're going to need your help. All okay. right, DJ? You like that idea? Love he loves it. You hear that? So first, here's what we're going to do. Get your car wash hands out. And first, we soap it like this. And up, down, 
and up, and now you rinse it. So you shake it on down. Oh, look at you, Mike. You were born to do this. Now wax it. Like wax this. it. Yeah, you gotta wax that car. Last, you buff it out to shine. Look at you. Ready? Soap it. Yeah, we gotta get the whole car. It takes a while. Rinse it. Look at you. Hello there, Fresno. We're gonna buff it. He's gonna be so clean. Again! Listen, you can see these ladies several times a day dancing all over Cars Land here at Disney California Adventure. Uh, it's a wonderful time to visit. The parks are beautifully decorated. Over at Disneyland, it snows on Main Street every night. They have the incredible fireworks show. And guess what? Zara, you've been mentioning this all morning. We are giving away a family four pack of tickets, park hopper tickets to Disneyland worth hundreds of dollars. That's coming up after six o'clock this morning. So yeah. we'll continue to have fun at California Adventure. <laughs> all right, Mike, practice your dance moves. We'll see you back in about 20 minutes. It is 546, 59 degrees outside our studios. A new hoax is making the rounds on Facebook. How is the social network using the content you post? And what can you do to protect your privacy? I'm Simi Das with CNET.com. I'll have that story next.